This over here is Bentley. He's the one who charms all the nurses. I'm holding Alyssa. The only girl, the oldest, and yes, the princess. We have Miles. In Latin, his name means soldier, which is pretty much what he's been. And Carter is in the corner. He's the even keeled one in this group. It's kind of amazing. They, uh, they don't complain or anything like that. They just roll with the punches. The Salaska quadruplets have gained about five pounds each since they were born September 30th at 24 weeks. Then they weighed less than two pounds. Amanda and Grant knew the chances of survival were just 50 percent for babies born that premature. We knew what the statistics said and we knew it was too soon and and um, but God, you know, that's all we can really say. I mean, the Salaskas are from liberal Kansas, and when it was too stormy to get to Wichita to deliver their babies, I mean, you just gotta do it. Amanda was flown to University of Colorado Hospital, awesome. oh. where now they are superstars. Yeah, that's actually the photo of them. <laughs> their picture is on the wall of the neonatal intensive care unit. <sighs> Dad and five-year-old Landon drive back and forth every weekend, so everyone's together. When all is said and done for four babies born at 25 weeks from the same mom, they're doing remarkably well. These babies are, to me, the closest I've ever seen to, like, a, a miracle. There you go, buddy. Multiple miracles for this family of seven on Christmas week. I don't think we have any, any big plans. Um, just to be together as a family.